Hello everybody. I've decided to do a match gameplay series of the Crisis 2 multiplayer demo. It was released for the PC on March 1st. Uh, I think it's been out for the Xbox 360 and uh, the PlayStation 3 for uh, quite some time now, but I haven't really seen many uh, comprehensive walkthroughs with commentary on uh, YouTube for this demo, so I think it's worth uh, covering. And uh, that holds us over until Crisis 2, the full version is released, which is uh, going to happen in about a little over two weeks. Uh, first what I'll do, um, well you can see here I have Steam up, and uh, I'm about to play the Crisis demo, or the Crisis 2 demo. I've played it a little bit, it, looks, it says that I played it for 30 minutes, but I think I played it longer than that. I was trying to reorient myself with the multiplayer version of um, you know, playing with a nano suit and all the different weapons. I'm not very good, so uh, you're going to have to bear with me. So let's enter it now, and then I'll show you the features inside. Okay, we're now in the game, and I like how it says press start to begin. I'm on a PC, so you have to click this. I think it was a port of a console multiplayer demo, but you know, some people really uh, lost their panties about that, but I don't really mind, it, because this isn't indicative of the final product. Okay, so now we're in the multiplayer main uh, menu, and you see how you could join a match. Uh, let's take a look at these other things first. There's this, the operative status. Uh, they're talking about me. By the way, here's a little uh, overview of your character down here that shows that I'm level 3, um, or I think that means I'm level 3, or the third rank. And it shows that I've, uh, I don't know what this is exactly. Actually, let's just go into operative status. And we'll, <laughs> I'm 1% complete. Uh, I'm not very complete of a character, am I? Okay, then you click it, and then it shows you, oh, I see, this is armor, this is like different experience levels, so I'm only level one of each of these, but I've almost gotten to the second level for stealth, and yeah, the third rank, uh, and it shows how, you know, you gain experience every match you play, and the more kills you make, or the more objectives you complete, the quicker you gain experience points. Here's some uh, general stuff here, it looks like, um, the hell? Yeah, I have 12 kills, so not a whole lot, but you know, I just started playing this. There's suit usage, uh, there's different modes of the suit. There's a, a armor mode, there's stealth mode, and power mode, and you gain experience based on how you use your suit. And here's all sorts of weapons in this game. I haven't even seen half of these yet, or I haven't seen hardly any of these. Um, in fact, the only ones I've really seen are towards the top. But yeah, see, are the ones that I've used like this, the frag grenade, uh, and then there's two different game types, I think, in this demo. Anyway, you get the idea. So now, uh, I have a feeling I'm going to have to turn this damn uh, music down, it's distracting. Here's dog tags, leaderboards, skill assessments, I wonder what this is. Yeah, so you get, I think what this is doing is just more of an overview of everything we saw so far. Um, you can pick a dog tag. This is, okay, let's, uh, Sanctuary, let's click that. So I guess that's my dog tag now. Yay. Uh, mystery, ooh, secret mystery. And then there's medals and awards. Oh, I, I guess I did. <laughs> At least shots fire. <laughs> well, it's not too hard to get that. Longest death streak. Hey, I won that, I think that must be pretty good. Um, and the clan tags. Oh, I guess you could create a clan, so let's do that. Daniel. Danny. And then nothing. Okay, well, great job, EA. Uh, and then there's all sorts of different options. You know, you should definitely uh, uh, work on your graphic settings. And you should only do this hardcore thing. And I even went further than that and did some custom uh, stuff, I think. But, um, no, no, it's disabled right now. Or no, it isn't. Uh, I think all, there will be more graphics options in the final product, but, um, uh, and then there's also controls. You know, you, you might want to tweak the way that you uh, use your controls. Uh, I'm used to Crisis and Crisis Warhead, where you change the nano suit mode by using the mouse, or the middle mouse button. You kind of hold it down, and then you pick your mode. 
Okay, so that's that's how that works, and we're now going to join a match. And I'll show you, it can be difficult to join a match. And we're not going to play in this this uh, uh, video yet. You know, the, the first gameplay will be in video number two. Um, but I'll show you how difficult it can be to, to get going on the server. Um, the problem is, uh, if you, once you do join a server, uh, everyone has to, I believe everyone has to be on the server for uh, uh, 30 seconds. In fact, we did. When I joined, it just happened to be, well, there's 11 people, but, well, you see how it works. And you can chat, and then, or you can just sit here and wait until the match starts. Okay, so we're going to start a new match, and we'll, and I'll show you how a match works in the next video.